you cancer free? Yes. Well, congratulations. Yeah, it's pretty good news, isn't it? Four years ago, Colin Cooley beat lymphoma. Two years later, that cancer came back. Chemo wasn't cutting it. Chemo, chemo wasn't cutting it. It was keeping it in check, but it wasn't going to get rid of it. So he started in a U of M clinical trial. The treatment is called CAR T. It's being called a new frontier in medicine. And it's now FDA approved to treat some children with leukemia. We we're able to take a patient's own cells and turn them into something that can actually attack their specific cancer. Dr. Edward Greeno directs the Masonic Cancer Clinic at the U. He met us at the fair where this treatment was the talk of the U of M's Cancer Day. There are some things, clinical trials and advances, that are small and incremental. This is not one of them. This is a major leap. Exactly. How does this therapy work? So essentially what we do is we take the patient's blood, separate out their immune cells, the T cells. They then send those T cells, which fight infections, to a lab to be genetically modified. We then process the T cells so they have on them a receptor, something that targets them specifically to the leukemia cells. We treat them in the laboratory so we get a lot more of them, so they grow and multiply, and then we reinfuse those just like a blood transfusion back into the patient. Since then, it's been getting better all the time. These are basically then just really revved up cells that are just missiles for the cancer. Correct. Doctors expect to offer this treatment for lymphoma next year and for other cancers within the next decades. Before, I didn't know if I'd be here in a year or two or three or four. I didn't know. And now I feel like I've got a new lease. Heather Brown. Some minor issues, yeah. but a new lease on life. WCCO 4 News. Uh, so far, this treatment's been used when other treatments like chemo have failed. It is very expensive. It could cost almost $500,000 a year. However, in one study, 83% of patients went into remission after the treatment.